Um, when you dealing with black, beloved, what up? It's some smoke in the city, beloved, beloved. When I tell you, when I tell you, it's like, uh, it's like sofa raining down on Sodom and Gomorrah. Y'all remember that back then? When, when, when stones of sulfur rained down from the heavens and destroyed Sodom and Gomorrah. Yeah. This is what's happening, right? Not in the literal sense, right? There's no, there's no uh, sulfur being thrown from the heavens, no. At least not yet. Uh, but this is how the wrath of God is raining down on a community of people. Beloved, on a city of people. There is a lot, beloved. There is a lot of people. A lot of people. <laughs> beloved. When I say there's a lot of people involved, there's a lot of people involved. And it is raining down people don't know what to do right now beloved asking god to please let up please on their knees begging please let up we are sorry god please forgive us we are sorry god god's remembering those warnings he gave that's what he's remembering. Those warnings he gave. So when, when everybody's, I'm sorry, God, God, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm begging, begging and pleading. God is remembering those warnings he gave. The prayers that we were praying to protect them even. Because we knew what was coming. Which is now here. And it's not good. It's not good. Nothing about it is good except for the repentance of, of, of witches, warlocks, Harry Potter, whatever you want to call it. Okay? Stuff ain't, stuff ain't sweet no more. You get what I'm saying? You get what I'm saying? Stuff ain't sweet no more. And it's, 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 like I say all the time, it's unfortunate, but y'all seen me on camera. Y'all seen me. Y'all seen me on camera crying, uh, uh, pleading for those who I, who I was talking to to walk away while they still had time to walk away from where they were, to walk away from what they were doing, to walk away from the environment and the people they were surrounding themselves with. They did not. They did not. Now they're trying to run away, right? Because mess of crap has hit the fan. But they can't run away. Why? Because they didn't take the out when God was giving it to them. So now they have to suffer the consequences. Right? Before they would have been light. They would have been light had they wised up. But they did not. So everybody will bear the same punishment. Everybody. Beloved. Communities. Communities are being turned upside down behind you. Behind you and behind God's name. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 345 on my timer. So uh, keep your ear attentive and your eyes attentive because you're about to see what exactly is going on. See, God's been shielding you from it. You, don't even ha you, you haven't even had to look at it. You haven't even had to look at it. Why? Because God doesn't want that on your mind. He doesn't want the heartache from what you will see these people going through because he knows it will break your heart. He knows it will break your heart to see them go through what they're going through right now. That's why we're not looking at it directly, right? But there is a time coming that we will have to face it directly. We will have to look at it directly. We will be in each and every person's face that has done something wicked behind our backs. Yes, there will be a day of atonement. Well, the atonement is here already, but... You get what I'm saying? There will be a day of meeting. Okay? Everybody will see each other face to face. 444 on my timer. Everybody will see each other face to face in one room. And you will get to look your accusers in the eye. Alright? And speak.
what thus saith the Lord. It's coming up. All right. Be prepared. All right. All right. I love y'all. Love it. Peace. <laughs>